Nacho, here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them from the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he could take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to. So in this to. matchup, prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Nelson is one year the elder. He is four inches taller. The reach is identical. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 18 wins, five losses, and one draw. He stands five feet eleven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Reykjavik, Iceland, Gunnar Gunny Nelson. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, Griffin rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go. The weight and the height gives way to the action right here on one side. Maybe the division's most well-rounded fighter taking on arguably the biggest submission threat in this division. Because he's such a great submission grappler, I believe that this is the most dangerous fight for him in the division. Wow. He needs to maintain his space, stay away from this guy at all costs, and force him to stand up with him. there he's trying to go to the body here unable to find the target man he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one the timing is on point he's doing a great job of mixing everything up and they are exchanging leather early well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick Oh, 
significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. To his right. Oh, that's a nice strike. The kick is there to the body. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Gunnar Nelson. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, wow! Head kick. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. There's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Big kick lands. You gotta move. Let's go. Just missed with that right hand. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Just got a range with that right hand. Good stick. He's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. 90 seconds to go in our opening round. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind-up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Nice punch by Nelson. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, big elbow. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Well-placed kick there by Nelson. Just missed with the left there. He is all about that left kick to the body. Look at the force behind that leg kick. 20 seconds left. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. Final seconds. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Right, almost like squeeze the job. Okay, okay, not bad. Alright, let's get you some highlights from that previous round. A lot of high-level leg kicking going on there, champ. And he did a great job of hiding it. He wasn't giving any sign that he was going to throw those leg kicks. That's why you didn't see his opponent check any of the kicks, and it won't take many more for him to really damage the mobility okay, of the two. other combat. All right, second round is underway. Your thoughts on what we saw over the first five minutes? I saw a very competitive round. It was very strategic. Expect these guys to really pick it up as we go forward in this fight. Huge block there. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Counters with a straight hand here, and it lands. Nice job by Lee. 
shots. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying active. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. Ooh, head kick lands is hurt. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Looking to land the right just out of range. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing it. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Ooh, big shot land. Checks the leg kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. That could have been lights out. And he continues to work the body here. Oh, just misses with the kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Beautiful combination there, and I'm not sure how many more of those power shots he can take. The night is almost over. If you keep getting hit with punches like this, you are going to sleep. Oh, nice combination of kicks once again. What a punch. Back and forth we go. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range on the feet. I mean, when you don't check, you're gonna continue to get blasted with kicks. His opponent has not deterred him from keeping on throwing those kicks. Just misses there with the left. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Punch to the body is blocked. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Just missing on the counter there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And that left hook landed on the button. Nelson's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Nice punch there by Lee. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, that's a good right hand. Went for the inside leg kick. Real nice body kick lands. Effective use of the jab there by Nelson. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kick... Time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's going for the first bat with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. 
he's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the screen. This is what happens. Very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next round. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Just misses with the straight left hand. Good punch land. Oh man, head to land. Just misses with the straight right. Hands up, hands up. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Nelson's got a pretty deep bruise now, starting to appear on the right side of his body. His opponent has done a lot of work in that region tonight. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Relax, relax. Keep your head. Goes back to that left kick once again. Big head kick land. Well, he misses with the left punch there. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. What a tricky head kick. Blow it up on that right hand, too. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Ooh, what a head kick. That one stuck in. Nice strike. He's trying to double up on that jab. Nice leg kick land. Real sneaky body kick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Back and forth we go! Trying to kick the leg out. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Oh, straight right. Nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Way to hide that leg kick. Just out of range with that right hook. Look at the angle of that nice body. Lands a punch. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Just out of range with that left hook. Lands with a right hand. Big leg kick land. Nelson's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Big body kick. It's okay. it's fine. Effective jab there by Nelson. 
Lee going for the head kick. No dice. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10-plus minutes of fight. Nice straight punch. Switching stances here. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. And both guys really throwing with authority. Just unable to quite find that range. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got to hurt bad. Nelson gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Just over three minutes to go. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Oh, huge block. And he's looking for that left hand. Just missed. Beautiful kick. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string it. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Jab yet again out of range. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good tonight. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Well, DC, no denying he's winning this fight. And it's got to feel pretty good if you're a fighter. You put in the work, and it all comes together on fight night. When it all comes together, nothing feels better. To go out there and implement the game plan that you guys have worked on in training camp, and it goes as desired. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, he gets back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, strong punch there by the way. Clean left punch followed by the right. Kick. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. 
And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Nelson gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. You got to whip his hip into that kick. Big leg kick lands. Nelson's torso, specifically that right side, has absorbed a lot of damage. Oh. Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get oh, him. he might be out. Nelson going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Lands the low kick. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one in the morning. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. Best head kicks you'll ever see. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. So here it is, folks. Fifth and final round. Whoa! Over the top. This fight's going to be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. But he's going low. And now he's got to hurt very badly. Ooh, what a punch. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. With a hook and he landed the punch there, or so it appeared. Nice job by Lee. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Lee's inner thigh starting to bruise up pretty good now. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Beautiful body kick. it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Wow. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Back to the feet. knockout here tonight near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the octagon tonight ladies and gentlemen referee dan mugliotti has called a stop to this contest at two minutes five seconds of round number five declaring the winner by knockout bruce the dragon Lee. all right so there he is the man of the moment celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his